Hey guys, Holiday Master here. Today I got a video for you of the Big Lot slash Techy um, six foot animated zombie. Uh, this is sold at uh, yeah Lowe's. Big Lots for 150 bucks. Um, last Friday they did a 50% off. I grabbed him and the Scarecrow. Uh, sadly, my local Big Lots only got these two and the Wolf. And I would love to grab the wolf. I, the, like, those three I love the most. I haven't even seen one of my local stores with the the ghost lady thing or guy or whatever it is. Um, but, yeah, if I got all four, that would be pretty cool. But I'm happy with the two I got. And i got to give a shout-out to Lucas. He uh, He's the one that helped me get them. So, huge shout-out to him. But, uh yeah so this is the box now i was going to do an unboxing but um techy loves to make sure their things are nice and packed there was probably 20 something ties holding this thing in the inner box so it took me 15 minutes just to get it unboxed and i i do like making longer videos but i i just didn't want to do that so but here's the box. It's pretty pretty cool design for what it is, you know. And then there's a code you can scan it to see what it does. Um, and there it is, 2024 Techie All Rights Reserved. Um, and it, I love that they. Uh, I mean, I don't care much for the battery option, but uh, I know like. The adapter option is what I love on these animatronics. So, uh, yeah, but there's the box. It's actually pretty big. It's about three man, three or four feet tall. Um, but here's the item. Now, I will say he's a really cool animatronic for a graveyard scene, which is what I've got going on right now. Um, now, I wouldn't pay the full price for this just because it's pretty much one motion. Technically, there's two, um, so there's only one motor and gearbox in this thing, and that's what makes the whole upper part move, but then the head is actually just loosely in there because it throws itself around. So, one mechanical movement, and then I guess the second movement you can say is, you know, gravity-based, um, but the lights, the eyes light up, um, that's pretty much it. Um, he's built pretty well actually um but yeah so right there's the sensor as well and that's pretty much it uh, you know it's a pretty basic zombie um pretty cool for what it is in my opinion like the details and everything again i wouldn't pay the full 150 for it but you know I, that's just me but uh yeah right now i have it on the try me button but I'm guessing the activation on sensor is the same thing. Mm. I will let you guys know now that this thing is a loud... Whoops, I almost dropped my phone. Uh, this thing is a loud prop as it is. What I mean by that is the volume's the, almost the whole way down and it's still loud. Mm, excuse me. But on top of that, the gear mech is really loud too. Just because, you know, it, it's... It's really well placed in there, but it still has the whole, the weight of pretty much the rib cage up plus the arms. So it's, you know, unfortunate that it's loud, but it makes sense. So I'm going to play them twice. I'll do it once lights on, once lights off. So here we go. Now, if you listen to the audio, and I'm, I might have to turn it up a pinch for this. So, you got him groaning and everything, and then there is a, um, like, in the background, there's howling of the wind. It sounds like a werewolf howl, like a faint one. But, uh, yeah, I know it's not, you know, pitch black because it's daytime, but, uh, yeah, here we go.
So yeah, guys, that's pretty much it for this video. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.